Three TV. We're here today with Greg Neumeyer, still life photographer for this quarter's technique section. We're going to be going over how to shoot bubbles. We're here with Greg right now. We're going to go over a few of the props and uh, supplies that we need to shoot bubbles. Greg, can you give us a little rundown of what we've got on the table today? Sure. Um, the supplies we have are a tray for your bubble water, coat hanger wire or armature wire. I prefer Joy. <laughs> Shoe strings, H2O. I use this little copper wire to kind of tie things together. And um, this is the basic lighting setup. It's very simple, it's two lights, um, a tray full of soapy water. Already, is there any particular mixture you have soap in the water in there already? Is there any particular mixture you have to stick with or is it something that's a little more experimental? Experimental. Yeah. I'm sure there's a method to this madness, but... Um, <laughs> You're not giving away all your I wing it. Yeah. No, I kind of wing it. All right, so I think we've just about got this wrapped up, this last final stage here, which obviously looks like one of the more. <laughs> and I'll just pull it up. I'll dip it in the soap and pull it up. Um, this is all trial and error. You can do. I sprayed a can of air at it and made movement. And, um, there's, you can just go on and on and on of different different things. I've made some armatures that had um, two circles in them mm -hmm. that would pull a bubble within a bubble. And, um, that makes very interesting shapes as well. And um, on some of the prints, you can actually see the the second bubble within it. Let's get wet and soapy. Should I take right. my shirt off or anything? <laughs> is this going to be uh... If you want. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, before we get started, I'm going to do a little test for the lighting, make sure our exposure is good, and uh, focus um, bubble. So here we go. First try. F22 at 500th of a second. We want to keep everything sharp. It's probably best to pull back and uh, crop later mm -hmm. so you're not all up into the bubble because the bubbles can actually go, on, they can shift around in different directions. Um, we can see what it'll do at 125th. It might, it might Expression of your your action so technically if yeah if we shut the lights off you could probably shoot this at a second just uh, your stroke off everything. all right well, we're going to see if we can pry greg away from the uh camera here for just a couple minutes to wrap things up it's uh, created some amazing images today yeah. it really was quite you know simple but beautiful it's an easy technique let's give a quick rundown a quick review of the kind of things we're going to need we're going to need the uh, soap dish a tray for your bubble water Coat hanger wire or armature wire. I prefer Joy. <laughs> Shoe strings, H2O. I use this little copper wire to kind of tie things together. <laughs> and um, always safety first, keep your camera packs. Greg, thank you so thank much. Thank you. Rolando, thank Rolando, you so much for helping out today. <laughs> and everybody, thanks for watching me TV. I'm Adam. Stay tuned and see what we got coming up next.